Yo, what is up everyone? Hope you're all having a fantastic day. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Tenrai 3 event, which I believe is actually the final event of this season. So the Tenrai 3 event will begin on September 19th and end on October 3rd. Let's go ahead and take a look at the event pass. So on the first tier we got an armor emblem, on the second tier we got a vehicle emblem, on the third tier we got a visor, on the fourth tier we got a stance, on the fifth tier we got a new helmet for the Euro Core. On the 6th tier, we got a weapon emblem. On the 7th tier, we got a nameplate. On to the 8th tier, we got a helmet attachment for the new helmet. On the 9th tier, we got a shoulder pad. And of course, on the 10th tier, we got the other shoulder pad. So those are the event items for the Tenrai 3 event. Now, personally, I do think having four different emblems, well, they're not even different. They're the same, same emblem on four tiers is a bit too much. It's a bit excessive. I will say, though, the visor and the the helmet i think looked pretty great i do think it is a bit lackluster compared to the tenrai 2 event but i think the event mode or rather the event map that is going to come along with this event is what will probably make up for it so if you didn't know we actually just recently got news apparently it seems like the tenrai 3 event will be the first event to actually have an event themed map so it seems like the event map for this event will be a map called Yurai, created by Lee Frenchies, I believe is how you pronounce it. So this is a community forge map that I've actually played on previously, so it is pretty funny seeing it make its way into uh, matchmaking, which is definitely great because it is a good map, and it fits the theme perfectly. So yeah, we'll be playing on this map, it seems like, for the event. Now, I'm not sure what the mode will be. Maybe it'll just be like a standard Slayer, but hey, man, I'll take it. I mean, this is the kind of stuff I want to see onward. I want to see more, I want to see more event-themed maps and modes like this you know to go along with the event so yeah i think this is a huge step forward and i'm definitely looking forward to uh trying it out and of course if you want to play on this map on your own or just take a look at it you can find it in the custom browser it's literally just called yuri i believe it's also in the 343 recommended but yeah it is a beautiful map and that about wraps up everything we know about the 10 ride 3 event let me know what you guys think about the event pass the event map not sure what the event mode is that being said consider subscribing and liking the video for more halo content like this and i'll see you guys on the next one peace